Hello YouTube, Mills Royer. More bloody questions for you. Um, what I'm thinking is, if you was running an engine and you had a um, a small chamber sucking all the heat out the exhaust manifold, getting the uh, some uh, water um, moisture, say the same moist air up to 700 degrees. And you then took that and put it into a chamber where there was a HHO flame burning. Um, my question is, how much HHO gas would it take to get this steam to crack it into into hydrogen and oxygen? It's meant to break about 2,000 degrees. Now, I haven't researched that to any full extent. If it was, say, a stationary, like a generator, and you had, you was capturing some of the exhaust heat for steam, and then putting it, jumped, what I'm thinking is a, a very small hydrogen cell, just a small amount to get a flame up. Um, if you're using a generator to get steam, make power to run a cell, and other things, You know, especially if it was resonating or something dreamy like Stan Meyer's production, something like that, and we could get the we could crack the steam further, you know, and then get a, a nice big flame from the um, from the from the um, hydrogen. What would be it'd be hot though, you know. You know what I'm thinking, and. Uh, should I even be thinking about this stuff? Let me know what you think. I'm, I'm not too sure. Um, just trying to get some more efficiency. All right, that's it for now. A nice short one for you. Get your brains working. 